And for those who actually want to be a bridesmaid, one woman is auctioning off the chance. Any takers? But this is an odd twist. Yeah, Kelly Gray, 23 right. years old. What she's is she trying to do? She's, she's auctioning off the ability to become her bridesmaid. Now you're going to meet a bride who has found some truly creative ways to make ends meet. Kelly Gray has been dreaming about her wedding long before she ever got engaged. When you're a little girl, you want to be a princess for a day. It's the one day you can feel special. The 23-year-old hairdresser has the fiancé, the dress, and the bridesmaids. But with a combined income of $32,000, the couple doesn't have the cash until a bridesmaid had an idea. So, you know, maybe what you could do is auction off a spot to be in your wedding. That's right. Gray decided to let the highest eBay bidder be a bridesmaid. Three, two, one. Holy moly! <laughs> As the auction comes to a close, the bids get bigger. Oh, my God! Final bid, $5,700. The winner, a Nick in New Jersey. Kelly, it's a guy. I know! <laughs> Turns out, Nick represents the Dr. Pepper Snapple Group, and the company is upping their own bid. I'm so thankful. Congratulations on your occasion. I think the winning bid was $5,700, but we want to make it $10,000. Oh, my God! <laughs> We can have a honeymoon. Like, I wanted my wedding, and now we can have a honeymoon. From NBC News, this is Today with Lester Holt and Amy Robach. And Kelly is here with us this morning, along with three of her bridesmaids, Blair Fass, Amy Carr, and Gwen Leyland. Good morning to all of you. Good morning. And congratulations to thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So you sold the opportunity to have a bridesmaid be in your wedding. I put it up for a penny, and I thought it wouldn't sell at a penny. I thought that was it. So when I started seeing some bids, I, I couldn't believe it. I was calling them nonstop, like, oh my gosh. All right, and, it, and, it, and we, should, we should say the winning bid was over 5000 and it came from? Um, Dr. Pepper Snapple Company. They actually have donated $10,000, and they're going to do all of our beverages for us. And Dr. Pepper played a big role. The couple raised money. This wedding brought to you by Dr. Pepper. The Dr. Pepper bride's big day has arrived. The Dr. Pepper her guests could do. Turns out that the Dr. Pepper company won the bid. Help came from a well-known doctor. They helped out so much, and and I couldn't have done any of it without Dr. Pepper. I really think I should be a commercial, Christine. Well, it kicked in $10,000 plus soft drinks for the big day. The Dr. Pepper bride pops the tab on her dream wedding. These stories always drive me crazy because you think, why didn't, why I, didn't think I think about it? And the diet tastes unbelievably like regular soda. Check this out. There was one last plug as the newlyweds rode off into the sunset with Dr. Pepper cans trailing behind. I look at you. It just matches. It just goes with it. Everyone who has a Dr. Pepper can, I need you to raise it high as we toast Dr. Pepper, their kind contribution to this event. So let's raise them high and cheers to Dr. Pepper. Cheers to Dr. Pepper.
Thank you to Dr. Pepper, obviously.